Hello Libra, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star Star Star, and welcome to your reading. So Libra, this is your reading for the month of January 2024, and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. Libra, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share, and subscribe, and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the video. There is an extended reading for this one. The link for the same is in description box and comment section. In the extended, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is the likely conclusion between you and this person. Coming back to this reading on YouTube, I'm shuffling the cards, I'll lay them down, and then we'll see your energy and energy of the person you're thinking about, you're dealing with, you will be dealing with. So let's get started now. All right, Libra, what do you need to know for the month of Jan 2024? We have the Fool, okay? You're very much willing to take risk. I think so you were holding yourself back from something or someone. Or maybe for the entire year of 2023, you were contemplating doing something. You wanted to do something, but you were, you were going back and forth on that. But now in the month of Jan, you are like, come what may, I'm taking that strong leap of faith towards something. I do feel like there is a new beginning. Or maybe you're starting something new, starting a new business or something. Uh, starting a new project. You will start working on a new project or something. The fool is certainly telling me that a new beginning is not far away. Okay. Or uh, there is something that you're going to learn. Probably learn some sort of uh something new i do feel like you're putting your efforts towards something new okay you are taking a strong leap of faith over there <clears throat> ace of swords i also feel like your approach is gonna be a no nonsense approach in the month of jan you will be considered as a high value person because you are going to consider yourself as a high value person in the month of jan you will be like You'll, you're going to keep all the conversations to the point. No running around the bush. No extra statements. <laughs> Only whatever is required. That's it. To the point. Precision is the key for the month of Jan. You're going to be very, very precise in the month of Jan. Okay. Some people might even think that you probably are acting slightly rude, but you're not acting rude. You're simply valuing your time. You're simply valuing your energy. And you're making sure that you're preserving your energy for the right situations and right people. Okay. People might even think that you're isolating yourself uh, by less because of less communication. Uh, or you're kind of... Probably some people might think that uh, you're keeping it low profile or you're keeping it low because there is something that is bothering you. You're under some sort of a stress, but that is not the case. People might assume hundred things about you in the month of Jan. Um, that's what I'm feeling. But what I feel over here is there is a shift in the energy, which only you are able to recognize Libra. There is something that is changing within you and you are only, only you are going to recognize that. Of course, of course, you will be always the first person to know that something is changing within you. Uh, and people around you will take some time to understand that there is a shift in the energy that's happening within you. And that's why I feel like, like precision is the key for the month of Jan. Okay. Uh, but because of that, because of the clarity that you're going to give to people, or because of the clarity in the conversation and uh, there will be a lot of authority as well in the conversation i do feel like a lot of your works will they will they will they will happen at a real great speed okay people will be very clear as to what is it that you want and 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 like say a work kind of takes around about usually of some sort of a work it kind of takes around about 10 days to happen it will happen uh, you, whereas in the month of jan the jan uh, the energy is such libra that a work for you will happen in in a day or two okay so that's what i see uh king of cups 
someone is eyeing you someone is someone really wants you libra whoever this person is okay for some of you libra i do feel like someone is taking a strong leap of faith towards you and this person is kind of desperate to talk to you this person has been fantasizing their entire future with you i mean if you watch the king of cups very closely you will see that the king is holding cups in both of his hands okay probably in another hand it's a wand in one hand it's a cup but when it comes to the to the cup cards the the king of cups is the highest suit card okay uh i do feel like whoever this person is they do have a lot of emotions for you loads and loads of emotions for you so it is likely with ace of swords next to king of cups it is very likely that this person might come to towards you with some confession might come towards you with an offer there are so many cards that are indicating libra that someone is coming towards you someone is taking a strong leap of faith towards you it can be vice versa in certain cases as well because the above spread is related to your energy okay so <clears throat> in certain cases i do feel like probably you are interested in someone and you really want to talk to that person and you're going to waste no time in letting that person know as to how uh how deeply you are involved in that person or how uh, how badly you really want that person if that is not the case i do feel someone is coming towards you okay to build a very solid uh from fast solid relationship okay so two of swords is indicating for some of you there might be options king of cups knight of pentacles i do feel some of you uh there is an so if i have to talk about the zodiac signs i see aries scorpio i see virgo i see capricorn some of you yes for some of you there are options but anyways i do feel for the month of jan libra you are going to get a lot of attention okay first of all there is a shift that is happening within you uh all those people around you might take some time to understand that there is an energetic shift that is happening within you but still something is getting reflected externally like there is a glow on the face okay uh and i do feel like your changed attitude if if you're going to be very precise in your communication people will talk about you a lot okay and even if you pass from one room to another room even if you walk from the passage you will notice that people are looking at you okay people are observing you yes that is what you're going to see people are observing you okay you are you will be getting a lot of attention in the month of jan libra and i'm not surprised if you're going to have like if you have uh, options over here i'm not surprised over here okay so but with two of swords it is kind of indicating that uh, you might find yourself slightly confused okay should i go to this person should i select this person or should i select that person like both of them are good and you might do some pros and cons at the back of your mind okay but i do feel like you are actually inclined towards a specific person okay but there is also a fear of getting hurt what if i choose this person but what if i get i get hurt in the future i don't want to go through that i mean if see at the end of the day if you are inclined towards someone if your soul is inclined towards someone it's always better to go with that person okay fears whether you select person a or person b the fear will always be there okay i mean it at the you you be a part of any damn situation whether it is romantic situation professional situation or any other damn situation okay when we are becoming a part of a new situation fear is always there 
how how i'm going to be restart a new job okay how i'm how my day is going to pass and how this is going to happen and that is going to happen we always have that fear and nervousness right but once we get acquainted with that situation acquainted with that person once we we know that person well then the the fear kind of subsides so don't allow fear and such kind of negative emotions to control your decisions so at the end of the day if you're feeling inclined towards someone just just go with that page of swords someone is watching you libra someone is definitely watching you i'm telling you the king of cups is really mad and crazy about you air signs for for uh, i got this energy more or less a similar energy for gemini as well i'm yet to do aquarius uh, but it kind of looks like for the month of jan this is a common energy for all the air signs like someone is watching someone is crazy someone is waiting for the right opportunity to come towards you <clears throat> I do feel like someone is stalking your social media. Someone is going through your social media pretty regularly. This person is trying to get updates about you. This person, I feel like this person has discussed you with their friends and family as well. They are waiting for the right opportunity to come towards you, and then they are gonna take a strong leap of faith towards you. There is someone. Someone is definitely watching you, Libra. Okay. All right. I hope this resonates and. Uh, Hit like, share, and subscribe, and comment on below. The link for the extended is in description box and comment section in the extended. We'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is a likely conclusion between you and this person, Libra. All right. Take care. Have a great time and happy new year. Bye bye.